What's good guys, it's your boy Money Mad. Today I'm bringing you a <coughs> I apologize. Today I'm bringing you a tutorial on something in controls called stick and move. But first I'm gonna tell you I am 10th prestige. So that is great, so great. Uh, and I've just tried to do this video then twice on Share Factory and it, it's all crashed out on me twice, so I'm just gonna try a different way. Or this will this will be just comment commentated on like the actual game. So if the audio is a bit worse, then I apologise. But I wanted to get this video out because I wanted to make sure I uploaded today. So what you do, you go into menu, you go all the way to options, you go to controls. As you can see, the second to bottom button layout is stick and move so let's just say you were starting off the game you, you'll start on controls like this where it's X to jump and then it's it's the right analog stick to knife or punch so uh, and then a lot of most people probably play on tactical where it's X to jump but the right analog stick to crouch or prone so basically that's how you do drop shots easier uh, me personally for the last two months I've been playing on a button layout called stick and move basically it's X to now use your melee attack or melee or whatever you want to say uh, and your right analog stick is now to jump so what what I what I would say is why I do this is because I was terrible when I used to try and jump shot with a uh, X so now I can jump shot most times with ease. Uh, I've started playing hardcore now as well, so you know it, it makes it easier. And as you you'll see by the video I put up in a minute, you'll see uh, you'll see how easy it was. So yeah, guys, I hope you like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more daily content of Call of Duty Black Ops Three. And until the next video guys, keep watching, you'll see all the gameplay in the background. And until the next video, I am out guys. Peace.